Hey, welcome to the show. This show is for Trisha, and she needs a little assistance doing this division problem right here. 1,288 divided by 21. So let's go ahead and get started here. Trisha, can I put 21 into 1? No, you can't. How about 21 into 12? Still too small. Can I put 21 into 128? I think so. So how many times? So I'm kind of guessing right now, but I'm figuring if I take 20 times 6, it would be 120. So let's go right over to the side here and do a little figuring here, a little calculation. So I'm going to take 21 times 6. So I'm going to go ahead and multiply 6 times 1 would be 6, and 6 times 2 would be 12. I'm going to try 7 just in case. So I'm going to take 21 times 7. So 7 times 1 would be 7, and 7 times 2 would be 14. So I definitely could put 126 into 128, and 147 would be just too big. So let's go ahead and put the 6 right here, Tricia. So I'm going to put 6 right here, and then multiply. 6 times 21 would be 126. So I'm writing 126 right here. And our next step would be subtraction. So I'm going to go ahead and subtract here, Tricia. And what is 8 minus 6? 8 minus 6 would be 2. And then 2 minus 2 is 0, and 1 minus 1 is 0. So now my next step is to bring the next number down. So I'm going to put the 8 right down here. I brought that 8 all the way down here. So can I put 21 into 28? Yes, you can. How many times? One time. So 1 times 21 is 21. And then our next step is subtraction. So I'm going to go ahead and put the line here. And then 8 minus 1 is 7. Can I put 21 into 7? No, you can't. Is there any other number to drop down? There's nothing. So then we have a remainder of 7. So I'm going to go ahead and put a little r right here and put 7. So our answer would be 61 remainder 7. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show. And thank you, Tricia, for reaching out for some help there. And I hope you have a beautiful and fun day. All right, we'll talk to you later. Adios. Goodbye.